Step one, signing in the park gate. So crew. <laughs> Orders, getting ready. Oh, we're here, day one, first Sun's out finally, so, you know, because uh, after we're done being yeah, you can see oh, no, the crazy amount of people here. Alright, so later on, we'll... <laughs> okay, day one's complete. We're at our first camp, and we're already so cold. <laughs> and it's only the first night. It's not really a good sign. But we're off to bed. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Karen Luke reporting live from the forest camp on day two. We're at 10,000 feet. Spirits are high today. Despite yesterday's torrential downpour, which hindered our movement with slippery conditions and a lot of sliding down hills. All in all, we're doing well, especially after last night's celebrations for Katie's birthday. We celebrated with carrot cake. Happy birthday, Katie. <laughs> today, spirits look high. People are very optimistic as we head out for our next day of traveling. Our guide, Lima, says it's six, six to nine hours of travel. We're very optimistic, mostly because we've never actually seen the mountain and we don't know where we're going. <laughs> and now moving on to Mel. Mel's in the mess tent. She's going to give us a down low on what's going on over there. Mel? Hi, this is Mel reporting live from the mess tent. Let's go in and see what everyone's got for breakfast today. We've got Mama over here, our fearless hey, guide. Good morning. And we've got the crew. What are we eating today, guys? Oh, bacon. Bacon. What? Bacon. 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 And there's a bacon shortage in the world, so we're extra lucky today. Oh my gosh. Fueling up, and we'll be out on the road soon. Back out to you, Karen. <laughs> Simba, everything the light touches is your kingdom. Gentlemen, today's joke of the day is brought to you by Allie. <laughs> so, why does Snoop Dogg bring an umbrella? Why? <laughs> For the drizzle. <laughs> 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 This is Karen reporting live from the trail. We're here with uh, Sebastian here. Sebastian, you look fabulous. Tell us what you're wearing today. It's all about the gators, you know. They kept me dry up almost all the way to the top of uh, Kilimanjaro and I'm still dry. Who are you wearing? Who are you wearing? Everyone wants to know. I think I can Ooh. see it. Tell us, from, tell us from top to bottom. <laughs> top to bottom. Well, we got the boots uh, kind of dirty from Colombia. The mm -hmm. gators, courtesy of uh, awesome Serengeti pride. Nice. <laughs> um, the uh, right. <laughs> pants, Serengeti pride colors as well. Colombia. Absolutely. And uh, I think these are uh, aloe beads. Mm -hmm. um, the girls like it, so I wear it. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. the girls. Um, oh! Shades, pilot shades. Where's I fly. Oh, so, uh, you fly. No, you fly. Really yeah. The so, huh? The flower? <laughs> uh, they died kind of getting legal oh, out, so I left them behind <laughs> trying to be environmental. Well, well, you look fantastic. We're going to look for some other people on the red carpet later on. Thank you, guys. Oh. So, we're live from day two. We have now left the forest and we've come to a very different landscape. Lama, would yeah. you like to talk to us about this landscape? <laughs> this is the part of the Shira Ridge. The Shira Ridge. Uh, we're actually on the heather zone. Heather zone. Everything is all, as you can see, it's all heathers. No more forest as where we were yesterday. Uh, that was Montana Forest. And now we're going to go down here. Yowie! On the line spot. And then with that, we'll continue up uh, hiking on the Shira Ridge to 11,500 feet. 
and a down tie. to 11 3, at home. which is the Shiro Plateau. <laughs> and how's everyone feeling? Everyone feeling? Thumbs Woo! up, thumbs up. After eight hours, we finally see our prize. There's Kelly. And this is where we are over here. <laughs> so we got to cross that plateau that's all day tomorrow and then start summiting that. <laughs> Got breakfast al fresco today. Still on the plateau on the mountain. Me and Karen just getting out. We're the last to rise. Whoops, whoopsie. <laughs> and the mountain. Dun, dun, dun. I don't know if you can even see that. All right, we're at a very exciting section of our climb. We've discovered a cave. In this cave, oh, there was an antelope bone, which means an antelope never got out. A dick dick. It was a also dick known dick. as a dick dick. <laughs> oh, what? A dick dick. A, dick dick. a small antelope. A dick dick. So now we'll descend into the same spot the dick dick did not survive, but hopefully we will come out. Damn, that was a skull of a oh skeleton of, a, okay. of an antelope. Uh -huh. Of an antelope. So that means that the antelope went in, but he couldn't oh. come out because. Oh, 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 Day four. It's so cold outside that we are coming to our tents. We got to the camp early. We went straight up for five hours or something like that. So now we're just cozy. Yay. And it's day four, so we're halfway there. Oh, living with no air. <laughs> All right, we're going a little bit cuckoo because we're so cold and so tired and smelly and smelly and just sitting up causes us to lose our breath <laughs> so with that it's time to, for us to lie down <laughs> <laughs>